Hi Earth Signs, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Ascendant, Sun, Moon, Venus, Rising and those of you cross watching, welcome to your Tarot Love Messages. In today's reading we're going to take a look and see what your spirit guides want you to know. So what is it that the Tarot guides want to share with you? What is it that you need to know and be reminded of perhaps at this point in time? It is going to be a general reading guys so please just keep that in mind. If you're after a personalized tarot reading with myself please feel free to reach out and inquire. I will list my email address below the video. Okay, some of you have been spending a lot of time on your own, okay, uh, maybe you've kind of um, shut yourself off from the real world, I don't know, maybe you've been in isolation lately, uh, uh, it just, it feels like you've kind of been spending a lot of time on your own, maybe you've been taking some time to be intentionally single here, um, all that time you've spent on your own, it, it's been wonderful and very healing for you, um, whether or not you realize this, but it feels like during that time you got to know yourself a little bit more. Um, and whether you realize it or not, you seem a little bit more kinder, a little bit more compassionate, a little bit more understanding and more gentle with yourself. So you kind of rediscovered who you are, maybe bits and pieces of yourself that you lost along the way. Um, you kind of, you know, you got to know yourself a little bit better. Maybe there have been some things recently that you've said or done that kind of surprised you here, but it's all paying off because essentially... A lot of you as well now know you know what you will or you won't tolerate you you'll know what you're made up of and you know you know just what storms you can endure here you know who you are and you know the type of um, partner that you might want to attract in your life or the type of ideal relationship that you might want to have and you're essentially setting and putting out the intention out into the universe and the universe is listening. It's listening and it's watching closely. And it's also responding to your intentions and your vibrations. And it does feel like with the Page of Cups energy, you do have some wonderful news coming your way regarding um, romance or regarding a particular romantic energy um, or romantic situation or relationship, a connection of some sort. So there is some very wonderful but surprising news. So for those of you that are single, um, you might not be single for very long. You might find yourself falling in love with someone very unexpectedly, very suddenly. Again, you don't plan for these things, do you? But you, whether you know it or not, you're ready for what's to come for you. If you're in a relationship and you're coupled up, you'll find that your relationship here is going to reach new heights. It's going to elevate. So you might be elevating the status of your relationship. You might be moving in together. Things might just be um, that much better between you and your um, connecting energy here. Um, it feels like things are about to take a very wonderful, maybe even a bit of a sharp turn, but a very wonderful positive turn, especially when it comes to relationships. Mm, they don't have to, it doesn't specifically have to be romantic. It can be relationships with your um, friends. It can be with your colleagues, your um, co-workers here, your siblings. But it feels like it's... Relationships, connections of all sorts are going to be very joyous, very harmonious. Um, just flowing with ease and fluidity. Some of you may also... Um, You may also be receiving some very unexpected, surprising news that comes from your um, your special someone. So there may be a proposal or an engagement or some sort of lo love offer that awaits you. It's, it's unexpected, but it's very deserving. 
The Queen of Swords here, she's inviting for you to speak your truth and for you not to hold back. Okay, so say what you mean, mean what you say, um, whatever it is that you, and you know what this is. Maybe some of you have been writing and deleting messages to a certain someone. Send off that message. Maybe some of you have been wanting to say something to someone. You just don't know how to say it. Maybe some of you have been wanting to reach out and communicate to someone, make a move. Whatever it is, whatever your truth is, speak it. Because it's important to you. You... You know, this person doesn't deserve any less, and nor do you. So the Queen of Swords is definitely asking you to speak your truth or to look closely, look a lot more closely at a truth of a situation of some sort. And the reason why you might be feeling very confused or uncertain about a situation because you're not looking at the truth of it. There's a lot of stability and a lot of abundance that is coming into your life, that is coming into fruition here. And... You do deserve it, but you've also attracted it because you've set the intention for all of this and you've been very patient by the looks of things. So it feels like the universe is finally rewarding you for your very hard work and, you know, for just your kind, gentle nature. And it feels like there's something that you've wanted, especially in terms of a stability. So whether it's, you know, a loving and stable relationship, whether it's a stable dream job or a career or just a lot more stability in your life in general. This is definitely one of the things that is coming your way. Also, it feels like the tarot guides want you to know that certain things that you have been through lately, although they've been challenging and uncomfortable and tiresome, they've, they've strengthened you. They've strengthened you. They've helped you grow and evolve and mature. And, you know, they've molded you into the very person that you are today. You know, think about it. Without those experiences, no matter how hard or difficult they would have been, you wouldn't be the person who you are today. So it's been, you know, it's it's been very strengthening and very also very healing for you as well. And with Temperance card, you're just being asked to stay patient. There's a lot of blessings that are coming your way, okay? Things are finally things that you've been waiting for, things that you most certainly deserve, okay, abundance, love, prosperity, um, you know, all these wonderful intentions and manifestations that you have been holding on to, it's coming your way, they did not get lost, they did not get delayed, they did not get, you know, detoured, they were always meant for you, and what's meant for you will always reach you, and it doesn't feel like maybe, you know, it's happening in your, in your timeline, but it is happening for you, it's happening for you at a timeline when the universe feels its best so be very patient because there's just so much goodness that's coming into your life make sure you create the space for everything here for all the goodness that's coming your way also for some of you if you've been feeling a little bit eh lately if you've been feeling a little um you know off key or off balance you need to find a way to connect to your center and try and find some balance in your life okay um the first thing people often do is go looking without it this all starts within okay because your outer world is essentially a direct reflection of your inner world so if your outer world is a little bit frenzied it's a little bit chaotic um, that's saying something about what's going on within so you know meditation um, relaxation techniques all of that is definitely going to help with this practice okay so it all starts with you here guys Okay, and these are your messages. Thank you as always for watching and listening. Please show your support by liking, sharing and subscribing to this channel. Bye.